Good morning from sunny Mallorca. My name is Michael and I wanted to do a podcast today about the announcement today from the Culture Secretary, Oliver Dowden, who announced today that the UK will attempt to move away from European data protection regulations and overhaul its privacy rules post-Brexit. Many will be cheering this announcement. Uh, of course, many are irritated by the cookie pop-ups and the consent requests online, and Dowden refers to rules based on common sense, not box ticking. But I've got my concerns. You only have to see the challenges, the electoral challenges, the challenges in court regarding Brexit, and how data collection, data mining, and the data transfers were all used very effectively by both sides, but arguably more so by the Brexiteers. He used the, the data that they managed to get from Facebook and other social media groups so effectively. Um, and I suspect that the rules that the UK government will introduce will, will be seeking to relax the protection that the EU did give the individual to know about the amount of data that a company is being held on them and what they do with it. Remember, data is massive. It's so big in terms of the commercialization of it. It's important from an individual that that data is looked after, but it's also hugely important from a company perspective because that's where your bread and butter is. So in some respects, I'm quite excited about the changes because it means from a company perspective, I may well get more work because it's going to be interesting to see how companies seek to maximize and commercialize the data. Uh, but I am concerned for the individual because ultimately the individual will be the one who'll be bombarded with flyers, bombarded with the understanding of what that individual buys and sells online every day. And so it's more important than ever that you are aware of data. And that's where we come in and that's where Stay Legal comes in. Because Stay Legal is designed really to protect the individual uh, in terms of looking at the data and advising companies and the individual as to what to do with that data. So it means going forward that exciting times ahead when it comes to how data will be assessed and it is going to be very interesting to see how they will manage the data flow between the UK, the States, Far East, Australia, and of course, how do we transfer that data to and within the EU? That is going to be fascinating. And the new appointment of John Edwards, who, who, who is a Kiwi, I believe, based in New Zealand, he's now coming over to be the information commissioner. It'll be interesting to see how he adopts and how he seeks to introduce international treaties to allow for the exchange of data. But I do worry for the individual. So, bearing in mind that these rules will probably take a year or so before they come into place, and there's going to be lots of debate, it's worthwhile now having that discussion with us all as to data. So next time we'll talk again about data protection, and have a lovely day, and we'll catch up soon. All the best. Bye-bye.